Hi, welcome to Here's Hannah. So it's the start of the weekend, so you know what that means. Adventure! I have Michael right here beside me. We're about to eat some Jamaican food and then we're gonna go see a comedy. Um, I forgot the word. Comedy show. A comedy show. A comedian. <laughs> comedian. Yes, yes. Kathleen Madigan. I think it's like the Bigfoot box wine tour. So that's, that's gonna be awesome. Is that what it's called? Yeah. <laughs> that's legit what it's called. I didn't know that. Yeah. <laughs> so wine is great. Only if you're above 21. We got some like festival, which is like sweet cornbread balls that look like hush puppies. Holy crap. They gave us a whole bunch in here. Yeah. They look like pancakes though. And then we got jerk tofu. Look at that. Taste the rhythm. Whoa, 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 it fogged up the screen. <laughs> Hi, it's Saturday. So the plan for today is to get coffee from this coffee roasting shop where they roast it right on the spot. Um, and probably just hit up some random stores because we need like random items. Like don't we need like more moisturizer? Probably. Yeah, so we'll see, we'll see how our adventure goes, and at some point we gotta eat, so I don't know what's gonna happen there, but tally ho. Or adventures away, whichever sounds cooler. We just got done eating the best food ever. We're driving to the mall to get moisturizer because we gotta have some supple faces because it's winter. <laughs> winter in Michigan is a harsh mistress. Very harsh. Like, pointy bustier harsh. It's not good. A pointy bustier! Like a, like a corset with oh. like the pointy boobles. Yeah, that's not a good mistress. Or, I mean, maybe. If you're into that type of thing. Um, I'm sure some people are. Yeah, some people are, but that's besides the point. So we're going to the mall to get moisturizer, and then I know we need to get to the store to buy cat litter. And then this one time in elementary school, I remember we had like a lockdown. It was like in second or first grade because someone's uncle, it was like my, he, he and I were like really close friends through elementary school. His uncle like escaped from prison or jail and he was like rumored to be out in the woods and so they wouldn't let us go outside for recess. What? Yeah, like no lie. I have like, never heard this story. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> like this happened and then like all the teachers like brought this kid into the counselor's office was like, hey, are you okay? He's like, whatever, it's just my uncle. <laughs> he does this shit all the time. Yeah, and then he, and then I talked with him and I'm like, what's going on? He's like, yeah, it's just my family, they're weird. <laughs> I'm like, okay. <laughs> Your eight-year-old Hannah being like, I just want to go out on this worm and have a worm fight, you know, play on the boardwalk. No, we got to stay inside and play like cards or dice or something. Pogs. Uncle I don't Don know. had a different type of worm for you. Uncle Don? Yeah. That's, I'm just guessing his name's Don. I don't know. I don't know, but... Uncle Tom? Uncle Bob? Oh, you're talking about the uncle in the woods. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that was a strange day. <laughs> I mean, a lot of days in elementary school. Sorry for anybody out there who's named Don. I'm not saying that you're a pervert. I mean, just implying you could be. I mean, the only reason why is because he escaped from prison, and they were like, "Oh, we got to protect the children." Just got back from the store, and all that fun adventure stuff. We are freaking exhausted, cause introvert life for real. Yeah, so we're probably gonna chill for a bit and then do some activities like play games or something we don't know we don't know yet we saved the man and gave him information at the store about game system so that was pretty cool but the the employee at the store bless their soul but they weren't really helpful was trying to sell a nintendo switch to someone and it was like this uh, middle-aged man and they were like asking questions like oh what kind of games comes with this and like sports stuff. I don't remember because I was playing a demo for the Switch, so Michael remembers more of it. Um, and then the employee was basically saying, oh, like we have Mario Odyssey, this is fun, and then there's this game, the Switch, one, two, Switch, and you can play with four players, and blah, blah, blah. But the guy 
was being brought around by this employee, and he's like, oh, I'm, I'm looking for, you know, a game system, you know, I want to play, you know, the, but I don't know anything, and basically the salesman was just kind of selling him on the Switch rather than actually telling him his options and stuff. Um, you know, the guy's like, oh, well, can you play this with multiple people? And the employee's just like, well, you could do, you know, you can play this game or that game, and you can get one, two, switch, and you can play Samurai's on it. And the guy's just like, oh, okay. Well, what about sports games? The guy's like, well, you can play Mario Odyssey, and they have Zelda. And the yeah. guy's like, all right. So then when the employee walked away, he just kind of, you know, was messing around with the, the box for the switch. And uh, just started asking us questions, and we were like, "Hey, you know, we'll, let's give you the the actual rundown on this." So yeah, so I mean, good good deed for the day. Um, but yeah, so we got our coffee, we got our other coffee, lotions. We're we're gonna be caffeined and moisturized. <laughs> All is good in the world. Hi, welcome to here's Hannah. So. I realized earlier this week that I did not put up the vlog video because I was having too much fun playing video games with my love. I combined last weekend's vlog video with this weekend's vlog video and that's the plan. So I guess this weekend is like the Super Bowl. I don't know. I think it's pointless because it's the same two teams every year and if I want to watch reruns I'll just watch The Office on Netflix. Yeah it's exciting, yeah it's cool, football's like not a bad sport, it's fun to watch, but I wish it was just some different teams because I don't really care at this point. Yeah, my plans for the Super Bowl, I'm probably just going to be sitting at home playing with Huron. Playing with Penny. Sitting in my lovely, lovely, cuddly house jacket and crocheting my temperature blanket because now I am almost half a month behind because it takes too long to do one row and I am also knitting socks and a shawl. So I like to rotate projects so I'm not bored. Penny is saying hi. She don't give two... That's a bad word, so I stopped. <laughs> Plan for tonight. I bought a slushy and it's really cold, so I'm gonna drink it. And then um, I'm just gonna kind of relax for right now. Finish up some stuff from work that I need to get done. And then yeah, so I hope it's a good weekend. Not too much planned. Um, Michael works this weekend, so I'll just be home with the cats. Doing chores, doing... Um, crafts and making food. So, uh, let's see what happens this weekend. I think it's going to be rather dull. I'm not going to see movies. I'm not returning to Comforter. I'm not buying yarn. So, yeah, well, we'll see what happens. Huron, are you a dignified cat? Meow! You look so mad. Why are you mad? Today's Sunday. Yesterday, Saturday, I spent all day filming South Park and Don't Starve. Well, I did one episode of Don't Starve. I just wanted to test it out on the computer. It worked out pretty well, so I did post that already today. But I need to, like get a stockpile of footage so that I can just edit and put it out for everyone. Um, so yeah, that's all I did yesterday. I did some laundry. Today I am making um, food for the week and I plan to work on my temperature blanket uh, so we can see how that goes. I do have to redo South Park again for a third time because I don't think things through and I just kind of do things and then when I show them to Michael he's like, whoa that should have happened. And I'm like, good point, good point. <laughs> I do have to redo South Park again. It's not that much I have to redo. So right now I'm making another burrito bowl and then I'm also making black bean, sweet potato, like three bean, like three pepper, chili. I don't know, I just kind of throw like ingredients together, kind of go off a couple recipes I find on Pinterest and I hope for the best. Well, I will show you guys what I'm doing. 
This is the pan I'm going to put my chilies in. Here I have a serrano pepper and two cloves of garlic. This is my lovely cutting board because I've been working so hard. Burrito bowl part due. Rice part due. I'm heating up some oil in my big pan for the chili. Throw in my, um, again, my aromatics, aromat, whatever, whatever the word is. I'm going to throw it in because it releases the flavor, flavors the oil, and then the oil flavors the rest of the dish. So, put those in there. I cut this whole onion and throw it in my pot with my garlic and serrano pepper. Chopped green chili and hot diced tomatoes with habaneros. Kidney beans, gray northern beans, black beans, sweet potato. Delicious. Here's the chili. I added some corn in there because chili needs corn. I think I'm gonna make some cornbread too because I don't know why I just have a hankering for it. So we'll see how that goes. My vegan chili. With avocado, a whole bunch of good stuff, and vegan sour cream. My sick setup. I'm all set to re record South Park again. So that's what I'm gonna be doing for the next like hour or so, and then we can see if we can edit it. I still need to crochet, I haven't done that yet, and it's already four o'clock. I have been doing editing and baking all day. Sorry, my my screen fell for my mic. Um, so I'm a little exhausted because I've been up since 7.40 doing non-stop, just trying to get content so that during the week I can just send set it out for you guys. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to um, start recording for South Park and... When I'm making my blanket, I'll show you guys some progress. So, all right. So here's my temperature blanket. I have 18 days of January. I have the first of the year here. This big row right here is Martin Luther King Jr. Day because that is the treble crochet. As you can see, it was rainy in the middle. This is where it was 56 and then it went back to snow snow <laughs> and then this is like 32 it will be like another purple and then i think it goes back down to like a blue so it's pretty so far just because the colors are so varied but um I, like i said this is only day 18 of january and we're in february so i am behind my goal is to try and get this caught up within the next week or so so i can just do one row a day um, but I don't, I don't know. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> My camera died. I had to change the battery. I think I'm going to try and figure something out so I'm not recording and doing vlogs the same weekend. It's a little difficult right now, but we will see. So like I mentioned earlier, this is going to be two vlog weekends in one video. Um, just because I forgot to do it last weekend because I was having a good weekend. Just taking a nice break enjoy this video it was kind of haphazard <laughs> i hope you guys girls ladies everything above have a wonderful rest of your week and if you have any comments just put them down below like and subscribe to my channel and i'm still trying to figure out exactly where i'm going with my vlogs and everything um i'm focusing on the video games right now but i'm gonna try and do the vlogs regularly as well but thanks for stopping by, and I hope to see you again. Bye!